Now we thought we'd sort of go out with just very quietly. It's time for some exercise with Lizzie and she's just brought along one or two of her friends to help her <laughs> in, in this last exercise workout. Here she is, Lizzie. Just one or two. I mean, we've had great guests over the years. Are you ready, team? Take it away. Yay. Give yourselves a big clap. to think that they tried to bring Come Dancing off British television. <laughs> that was amazing. We're joined by uh, a family of presenters here, and let's just ask you really, uh, almost finally, what the defining moments of TVN, things that define TVN. What about you, Lauren? Very recent, actually. You know, we had our farewell lunch. We came in the next day, and we were both still drunk, I think. Honey. Half cut, <laughs> and um, your man was sober. Ollie Reid was sober. Reed was sober. Yeah. And we were half cut. That defines And I think TVN. that sums it up. <laughs> yeah, Lisa, what about you? So exhausted from all that. <laughs> um, for me, I think it's very visual colour. The pinks, the yellows, the greens. And to me, that is warmth, which leads on to family and friendship. And yeah, family, Good. that feeling. Mm. Okay. Apart from the people that I've already talked about, I think there's one moment I, I will always remember, and I was so proud to be there. It was when I was working on GMB with you, and we had Ben Kingsley and Anthony Hopkins on the sofa and they discovered coming out of Russell Grant doing the horoscopes <laughs> and, and we would never have discovered this had we not had Russell Grant doing the horoscopes that they were both born on the 31st of December yeah. and, and they were great pals anyway and that just gave them such Which a good one th of they just, it really was such a good program and, and I will never forget having been a presenter on one that one moment that defines TVN for me is curiously involves Anthony Hopkins now Sir Anthony Hopkins <laughs> 
He was in makeup, and one of the makeup ladies, a great department, but department. advanced towards him with a huge green wig. I said, "Here's your wig." He said, "I'm sorry, that's not for me. I'm Anthony Hopkins." No, I'm sorry. This is your wig. No, I'm really sorry. I am just appearing the normal. No, I'm sorry. This is your green wig. But, um, of course, it emerged after after a long time. It was Mr. Mallet's wig that, was, that defines TVM for me. And Catherine, well, that's well, what do you say to Catherine? Oh, well, there are bizarre moments here. Bizarre mixes of guests. Mm. The Stranglers and Thora Heard ending up having breakfast <laughs> together Brilliant. after appearing on here together. Absolutely mm. remarkable. I'm coming in as a reporter from interviewing Tom King and finding Jason Donovan doing his video on the stairs. There'll never be another place <laughs> like Wonderful. it. Wonderful. <laughs> Wonderful. And there's good news. Give us the good news. Yes, I'm having a baby at the end of July. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, well, well, congratulations. Thank you. Well done. Well, it's nearly time to say goodbye. Recently we've had an absolute avalanche of letters and cards from viewers wishing as well. Well, it's high time we thanked you, the viewers, excuse me, <laughs> for your loyalty. Yes, even now, uh, take her. Yes, even now on our final day, we remain uh, quite easily the most popular breakfast television viewing. Thank you for that. We wish the staff of Thames TV, TSW and TVS all the best on their last days as well. But now, uh, if you'll just forgive the self-indulgence for time, it's time for the last farewell to our staff. In the words of the song, and I know it's a cliche, they're simply the best. Ah, what a bunch of rogues, and you're the biggest rogue of all of the kids. Mm. What was the name I can repeat? And now you know I'm going to be a passport photographer. That's <laughs> right. We'd like to thank everybody who's uh, been watching TVM. We've enjoyed your company. Yeah. But from TVM, sadly, we now have to say it finally thank you and goodbye. Happy birthday. Uh,